Tabes et felis solo tumuit armis venit pluviali, vel focibis auida mores necne, hecres tristes, e non cupidum eorum. Zuna, guide me. Sessionum in cognostime est in sessio. Quot somenum omenum sessio. Lies ahead. There you are, Gunner, and with a smile I haven't seen in some time. Eivor, over here. Eivor, thought I smelt you under wind. Gunner. With the speed you left home, I thought you'd been carried off by Valkyries. I have. This Valkyrie right here. Bridget. My own heart's root. Meet Aver. It takes a rare woman to nail down our gunner. Lavendin da. With my Zigwili. Uh, good to meet you as well. How did you find a woman in these backwards? She came through the settlement selling runes, outshone every stone in her satchel. She offered me a trade, a rune for a brooch I was making. I got a better deal. But she loves the ugly little thing. Have you a family, Bridget? That mom and dad carried Evan Gillard and Anon. Couldn't help Drew's me. Bridget man power the last high priestess and elder man. They since passed on, but the current elderman looks out for her. I should like to meet this elderman of yours, if our kinfolk are to be joined. A union forged in love. Come, we go find him. Oh, and don't blame me if he's heard a tale or two about you. What about it, Bridge? Tim Jolch, you two bags of air see how good pass killed. That evil girl, Cleese Lown. Right? No daylight to waste then, huh? Eh? So the Elderman may have heard a tale or two about my exploits. Not all from me. Your name will be on the lips of every skull for years to come. <laughs> and the merchants here are not unsettled by lurking Vikinger. They come from all over to celebrate Samhain. 
Most are too busy with the festivities to pay us why. Sawan, is that what these cab roots are for? This tradition? Aye. Faces cut into lanterns to ward off evil spirits and guide children home. They have a haunted look about them. Let's bring a few back. The elder man, Kunan. A good leader, seeing to his people's needs. Let us join hands when his task is done. Yeah, then let's introduce you to Tevder. Hands as clammy as a dead haddock, but his heart is in the right place, and he'll be elderman after Kunan. Tevdor, this is Eivor, my chieftain. Ah, uh, yes. The way Gunnar speaks, I expected, uh... Me to ride in on a winged horse, cure the sick and the blind. His compliments are as blunt as his hammer. Ah, more pagans crowding our table. Just lovely. Well, what brings you here? I'm here to hasten my friend's marriage, and drink my weight in ale. If friendship comes afterwards, then all the better. And what has Dane friendship done for Christian Mercia? Unseated god right kings for puppet rulers? I'm here as a friend to Gunnar. I do not like to make enemies when breaking bread. So tread careful, boy. Apples! Eivor! Wait until you try the cider. You you like cider, eh? Tevder? Cider? Uh, ah, you must be Eivor. Tevder, I see you've welcomed our honored guest. Come just in time for my last sowing. At your behest. We welcome all pagans set upon God's own Gloucester. Tevder! As your harvest king, I demand that you remove the turnip from your arse and be merry. So you've come to meet the family before you whisk my Bridget away to her life as a smithy's bride. We're honored to have her join the Raven Clan, but your lush landscape will be hard to match. I must give away girl and land in this misty season, but Gunnar is a good man, and he speaks tirelessly of you. If you will excuse me, I have matters to attend to. Ah, yes, the shrine. And with so many thieves and fangs on the path, a fellow may fall in God's service. Kunon, I do not need a heathen escort. Youth cut down in its prime, without even the memory of warm thighs and cider to sustain him in the afterlife. Then, by my honor, I shall not rest until I return him to you safely. I, Tefter? I see I am outmatched. Though a Dane joining in praise to Saint Kenhelm? God will weep. My lady love calls, Eivor. Oh, if you'd like to join us later, we're going hoodening this eve. Go, may you have a fire-forged friendship. Watch for fairies, fenfolk, and fiends. I have a hand fastening to oversee, an apprenticeship to officiate, and a pig to slaughter. <clears throat> well, shall we then? Sowen. <laughs> Kunon humors these pagans too much. It is the first thing gone when I am Elden. Fires and magic, spirits in the air. Gloucestershire has strayed from God's light. People need carousing, especially before the winter frost. The festival brings warmth and cheer. God's light does not dim as the nights chill, but the winters are hard upon the children. Seeing them run around, it lightens the heart. Are there priests in your lands? I've met a few, liked even fewer. The profane has gone unchallenged here. 
I alone am the reformation. They are a flock in need of my shepherding. And how will you lead this great renewal? They will fill the church's pews, and we will thank him for all the gifts he brings. Not false idols of wood and clay. And yet, are we going to pray at the idol of another? Is this Saint Kenelm your god? No, and we do not call him such. He is simply closer to the Lord's ear. Lo, in a meag of kine under a thorn, lieth poor Kenhelm, kingborn. Is this land not beautiful, Eivor? Aye. Look, the path is untouched by danger, so your company is not needed. You're a kinder man than the mask you wear. You won't be rid of me. I'll keep my word to Kunan for your safe return. I don't understand this Christian praying. I thank Odin while standing. Why get your knees dirty? To humble ourselves before God. Besides, I've dirtied my knees doing worse. That sounds like a tale I'd like to lend my ear to. Please, Eivor, I must pray. Should I watch or turn my back? Oh Lord, gift upon this lowly servant your greatest gift. Patience. I'll not have to interrupt your prayer to protect you, Teftir. And yet you insist on doing so. What is it you are looking at? A hare? Tefter, get to safety. Find somewhere to hide. Where did they come from? Bell the swine! <laughs> Eivor, thank you for saving my life. It is good I was here to protect you. Maybe Kunan has the eyes of prophecy. Splued, cloven hoofed and sent by Lucifer himself. This land must be returned to God's grace. More likely the shrine is in their territory. Lord, we thank thee for your protection. It's not safe here. Give me my moment's prayer, Eivor. I ask only this. We should return to Gloucester, unless you'd like to thank the little martyr here for tonight's feast. I'm not a babe in the woods in need of constant guard. Go on without me. I gave Kuna. Yes, yes, your word. And when I see him, I will say you protected me from being skewered upon those devil's tusks. Oh, and Eivor, I owe you a drink at least. Later, if you'd have one, find me at the festivities. Here I am. So, what adventures did you find in my absence? Escorted Tefter to the shrine of some Christian saint. Our path was not peaceful, accosted by a singular of boar. Odd, but path and I usually serve. To the brevo. But you saved his hide. I bet it was quite the sight, two of you as a pair. 
I kept my word to Kunan, and that spatchcock Tevdir lives. Restraint, Eivor? I was half expecting you to wallop the lad around the head and ass. I've bridged hands with most of England, Gunnar. And I've held my temper around worse than Tevdir. I need a drink. Try the cider. It's from last year's apple harvest. Skull. Skull. So, you invited me to a hoodening. What mischief is this? Nigwiskal Anvil is spread down in Creatures of the Vale. The bag for treats. Clara Shister gives her glut to otherworldly visitors, and if you dress as one, you'll get that bounty yourself. Freely given. <laughs> I've only seen such a thing done at feasts. Then we turn you into a beastie and have you roam the hills, braying for sweets and drink. It's hardly a disguise. Just a cloak and some bones. Nonsense. You are the very spirit of the Mary Louved. Now, let's hooden. Become the Mary Louved, the spirit who sings for cake and ale. And you cannot have your cloak back until we leave. I'll keep this covering, but even a knife to my throat could not make me sing on command. Shame. Gunner, if no one else is dressed this way, I'll fill your shop with sheep. That house for sure. Trick or treat! What business have you? Oh, the Mary Lewid. Right, right. We're doing cakes instead of beer this year. Sowing night and the moon is high, Mary Lewid haunts my door. Give me sweets and candy treats, the kind I most adore. <laughs> Here then, sweets for the Mari Luid. You've earned it. Are you playing the role of trickster spirit? Can trickster spirits see? The eye holes in this mask are terrible. All it takes is a mask and some sweet cakes to turn you into a gentle skull. I am not going to sing, Gunnar. Are you ready to rhyme with me? Down the road, from my abode, there is an open veil. Hope to God this Mary Lewitt doesn't fail. Ah. Oh. Have a cake for your troubles, then. Ah, uh, lads getting into their cops, scaring the wee ones. Get it! Oh, thank the gods. We've been waiting for children all night to empty our store so we can go to the party. Have some extra. <laughs> Look at these cakes. Sweet as honey, Gunnar. You should see this. Gunnar? My cakes. I need your eyes, my friend. Gunner! Oh, damn, deserter. I cloth is. Take your false gods and piss off back to your shit-smeared hovel. You are either fearless or stupid, boy, to speak to someone of the Raven Clan this way. Fitting name for scavengers. Winged rats taking what isn't yours. I'll pick out your eyes and feed them to your god. Gunner, we are guests here. Let them go. We can hood more. <laughs> You seem to want your nose broken, so let me oblige. Christ, I'm tall. It's you lot we should be burning alive! Are you 
sure you don't want to stay in Gloucester. They know how to have fun. I don't answer to you, witch. Thomas Fletcher, I brought you into this world, wiped your mother's birth blood from your face. Mind your tongue. Let's see that leg, then. It's nothing. Careful with the old man. He's had many winters worth of wounds. Tilukis. Modron's a compass to patch this land. Will he walk again? The gash is deep. If I cannot save the leg, the pigs will eat well tonight. That man called you a witch. I lead those who follow the old ways in Gloucestershire, but I offer my healing services on both sides of the river. Gwenith, my love, go back to the house and bring me the garlic salt. And the worms? Are we cleaning or cutting, mother? Yes, grab the worms just to be safe. Now go, child. I promise not to cut it off before you return. I'll give me strength. My mom modern is known I'm a humor toish gudran. I'm glad you all finding my mortal injury so funny. Go, Aver. Make Mary and try to loosen Tempter's shoulders. Modran. You do not have to save his leg. I'll understand. That limb will be fine. But no medicine in England will stop the dribble from his mouth. I do not work miracles. Bye, BC. What's left of me? Bitter ale and sweet friends. That is a fine way to end a day. Alone with your thoughts at last. Eivor! <laughs> Perhaps. Every moment is sweeter when you are the Harvest King. All this bounty. Soon, I will join it. But eat, drink, enjoy all that Gloucester's lush woods offer. I thought the church condemned this celebration. I hate the church. Name's Gwarim, and I turned to God just three years back. You look like a man with a past. What were you before you took up the cloth? Me? I, a, a grain farmer. Had to take up the sword a few times to protect my crops. What brought you to God? You know you need to change after the third night you wake up britchless in pig shat, with no idea how you got there. Do you like Gloucester? Ah, tis a beauteous place. Shame they're losing their elderman. Enjoy the festival, Quillam. Ah, perhaps a drink later. <laughs> Eivor, there you are. Tefter. You're well met. Gwilym here has challenged my honor in a contest of drinks. Join us. The lab will be easy pickings. Give me a cup. Some ale, then. One for me as well. Gwilym, the warrior monk. Now we can match wills with a flagon in hand. <laughs> ale is known to blunt even the sharpest of plates, Eivor. 
To holy hearts and humid eyes. It is the best drunkenness returns a man to royal reason. Skull. feeds my soul. Here, another drink on me, for allies new and old. Of all the Eldermen I've met, you are the most unburdened. What is your secret? None. It is well known. The burdens I carry will soon leave this world with me. So drink to my life and death. Death? I am to be sacrificed in the Wicker Man as King of the Harvest. Like Elderman Simkin before me, and all before him. Horrible barbaric practice. A burnt offering after poor crops. They hope well-fed gods will smile upon them. A true father sacrifices himself for his people. Gives his all, his blood and flesh. A great honor, but a sad fate. Hmm. Huh. When you speak these words, it reminds me of the Christ. Aye, lad. Now you can see how a man like myself sees the value in both. A toast, then, to Elderman Kunan, joyous and generous. Let each man show him loyalty until he suffers death. My friends, you are kind to me. I'd like to toast my successor, Tevgar. May he wear the horns head high. I feel like Thor chugging oceans, no effect to my head or step. <laughs> you heard the woman. Give her something stronger. <laughs> this will work faster than any tonic. Good. Give me visions of all creatures that roam these hills, and the sore head tomorrow to pay for it. Wow, that tastes awful. It feels good, though. They all speak true. My feelings be damned, I have been an ass. Do not deny it. And I, for that, I am sorry. A colossal horse's ours, yes. Soft words from a heartless heathen. Only fiercer than fire among ill friends. I can be very as nice as a spring gale. <laughs> and how nice is that? Tevter, with Gunnar and Bridget's marriage, our clans will unite. But we could join by oath as well. Oh, yes. My first ally as Elderman. I accept. We shall make an oath. How do we start? 
Yeah! The greatest, greatest oath and the greatest union. To the oath! The treaty! The greatest! <laughs> People are sleeping. More ale to seal our friendship? This way, this way. Look out for the black sow. Sow? Like pig? Flaming pig. Chases you home at night. <clears throat> silly words to scare silly children. Ha! <laughs> you see magic. That's the stuff of children's dreams. Perhaps... I judge too much. Truths I half believe. Foolishness sometimes takes my tongue. I have to piss. <laughs> A great blackness chases stars across the sky in great whirls of color and light. Whoosh! Here we are. Right inside here. Tefter! 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 Where are you? <sighs> Hell's breath. What happened last night? Ugh. The effects of that draft still cling. Tefter! Tefter's bodyguard, killed by knife. This pot has been broken, and it's covered in blood. A weapon, maybe. Blood. Could be Tefters, if he was the heavy thing being dragged. This God's Muddy footprints. Someone was hiding back here. What's happened here? Open this door! Come out of there! Quillam. 
Adam's pouch. I wonder if it still has his little something stronger. But why is it here? Better hold on to it. So, what does this lead to? The murderers hid here. Lying in wait while we approached outside. They jumped from the shadows to kill the bodyguards. And to disable Tiffany. And they dragged him away. That accounts for everything. Except Gwillem's pouch of herbs. I'm still unbalanced by Gwillem's special something. Maybe Mother Mordron will know the contents. There she is! What is the meaning of this? Blood soaking our soil, and your weapon coated in the same! Kunan, please. More has happened here than you can see. Give me a right to parley my innocence. I should have heeded Tevder's misgivings about heathen party guests. And now he has paid with his life. With Tevder gone, Glowichester will be without an elderman. Eye for an eye, your Raven clan will lose their chieftain. Get the murderer! blood from the new king. It would be best to lie low. Hello there. Thank you. I always need more of these. This could come in very handy. Leaving already? I'm off. My eyes. <laughs> Cast about this land, my friend. 
There is more to run, Abel. Hello again. Mother, it's the friend of the mangled leg man. Eivor, you remember. Indeed. It's a surprise to see you. Is everything quite all right? Do you recognize the contents of this pouch? A very unusual blend. There is a druid who uses this mix to aid sleep. A monk called Gwilym poured some of it into my drink last night. The effects were intense. Search the houses! Can't have far! Damn Christ, sons, what is it they want now? They make this place unlivable for pagans. Mother, if the stranger wants more of the herbs, they can talk to the druid Halewyn. Yes. Halewyn's cabin is on a lake, near where the Cherwell and Great Ouse rivers meet. But he is a strange fish. Rarely does he speak to mortals, preferring the company of spirits. Now, I have business at Rollandrich. Find me there later. Fellow's land is peopled by men of straw. Just as Mordrin said, 
maybe I should disguise myself. Spirit, you have finally come. Days ago, a passing cloud foretold your arrival with droplets of sun-scented rain. But what form of being are you beneath this guise of horse and bone? From the realm of the Fey? I know you cannot say. I, I press no more. Whatever you be, now you are here, the ritual may begin. Oh, but the men of straw must announce you with sparks. Ignite the sky to begin anew, here at the death of the season. Until then, I await you, giving thanks in the glen. I should set them ablaze. Ah, a wickerman speaks. Now let them speak in chorus. Yes, another joins the throng. Be cacophony! One more! One more! They roar! Do you hear them? A chorus of fire! That should be the last one. Back to the druid. Speak to me, O oh wind! I have come to ask you a single question. Something about your demeanor and your physical manifestation now gives me pause. Are you truly a spirit of light? I'm a spirit as any other. Then prove it. You must know the depths of the world's mysteries before I will help you. Tell me the proper use of charms. Very well. Ask your riddles. Man and woman are made of earth, of water, and wind. Which charm clods the earth, dries the water, and stills the wind? Give me a measure of time. Are you a spirit of darkness? If it be not so, come back and try anew. What are these things he's asking me? There must be trinkets around his house I will help. Hangman's noose, a knife, and the vile smells of poison. Three ways to kill someone. This dagger is placed upside down. Their mouths are open, like they've been screaming secrets. This symbol is one I've seen, carved into shields and headstones. Speak. 
Speak to me, O oh wind. Have you found yourself? If you are a spirit of light, answer me this. Man and woman are made of earth, of water, and wind. Which charm clods the earth, dries the water, and stills the wind? Threefold death stops life's wind, returns a body to earth, and renders water into poison. Threefold death is the charm. Which is the charm that weds souls? The charm of the double spoon. Yes, such that a wedded pair can sup broth together. Which charm is it that gives speech to the dead? The Skull's soul's charm summons voices from Death's realm. In such fashion I speak to Druids long dead. But of course you, a spirit, would know that. <laughs> you are a spirit of light. Mabon be praised. Would you like some bread and cream? No, just the answer to a question. This herb pouch made its way to Glowachester in the hands of a strange man. Do you know it? Aye. A mix to help him sleep, I filled this very pouch. And over a dandelion wine, he spoke fondly of his home, Kuthladrin. Kuthladrin. <clears throat> very well. I thank you, Halloween. But this spirit has others to visit this harvest moon. Go with the wind and leaves, good friend of the hills. Kuthladrin. Strange name. Meanwhile, Modron awaits me at the stones nearby.
survey the area soon. I can see Modron ahead. Modron, well met. Gods, someone save me. A murderous Dane is here to sever my head from my neck. You could have told me of your plight earlier. We are both friends of Bridget, and I know you would do nothing to jeopardize your friend. That night was full of drink and merriment. I do not remember much, but I had no quarrel with Teftir. A sorry tale. Did you learn anything from Halewin? He gave some herbs to a man from Kuth Ladrin. Name of Gwilim. He was drinking with Teftir and myself. Kuth Ludrin is the Welsh name for the thieves' warren. It's atop a hill west of here. I can lead you. I owe you a great deal for all your aid. You did not have to trust me. Tevder's fate is to my interest as well. This is a troubling development that I hope to get to the bottom of. Let us make haste then. I must find Gwilim and regain my honor. This forest and all Gloucestershire feels untamed. I feel as if I've ridden my horse through it. This forest and all Gloucestershire. Where this forest and all Gloucestershire feels. This forest and all Gloucestershire feels untamed. I feel as if I've ridden my horse through a door to another world. Aye, there is old magic here. Old magic that would be snuffed out by Tevder and his church. Tevder did speak of reformation. Do you think that's why he was targeted? There are many who would claw their way to the top. Tevder's disappearance could be the work of any. But you are a witch. Open to wisdom from the gods. Have you seen anything? I see much smoke. Are there any rival days? Kuth Ludrin, the thieves' warren. This is where I leave you. You'll find somewhere safe. There's a shrine nearby. If you've need of me, then meet me there. Gods old and new go with you. Attack on sight here.
Be where Gwilym is hiding.
Need to get on the other side. Oh, shit. Oh, shit is right. Eivor, you're alive. Have mercy. I were under orders. Elderman Kunin, he gave us coin to dispose of Tepter. Then he should demand it back. Shit sells swords, you are. Cannot kill a single man. You made a poor choice and scapegoat, Gwilim. And we thought that if we kept the lad alive, we could squeeze Kunan for more coin to keep it secret. Why would Kunan pay to have Teftir killed? He is to be his successor. We ain't ones for details. The less we know, the better, yeah? You chose to extort the man, but you have no basis for the crime. You're imbeciles. Look, we wasn't gonna kill the lad. We've come to like having him around. Tell her! Tell her we've taken care of you! Kunan did this? Why? I've done nothing to... Oh, gods, is he dead? Wake up! Wake up! Tell the Dane I've hand-fed you like a baby sparrow! Ah. Move forward! Ah. Look, Eivor, we're mates, right? Uh, had drinks together? Remember the chickens? Speak again and I'll take your tongue. Tafter will need to see a healer. This lord have been smearing dung on his face. But I've been held for ransom by worse men. Thank you for your aid, then. And try not to get held for ransom a third time after you flee. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. It is much appreciated. When I awoke in this demon lair, 
I feared the worst. Save your strength, Tefter. It's a long ride. Kuno. He ordered my death. I don't understand. He's been like a father to me. I will ask him myself. I was mulish when he spoke of the pagans being just as we. Living in kindness under the laws of many gods. One face, many faces. It matters not. We are all hey, blessed right. to be alive in his glory. Accept your will. One face, many faces. It matters not. We are all blessed to be alive in his glory. This scrape has changed you, Tefter. Changed me. Changed the dressings. He's hurt to the touch, and his mind fades in and out. But he lives. Perhaps a sickness of the blood. Shame, shame. He was captured by the men there? They claim to have been hired by Kunan. Kunan did this? I know not why, only that he gave them coin to dispose of Tefter. You can see how well they saw to that. They were alike once, the boy and Kunan. God-fearing Christians arguing the nature of life with me. But he softened. Men do great evil to cling on to power and save their skin. Perhaps he means to put Tevda to flame in his place. Does not the right demand the leader? If he made the lad's body elderman, then it would still be right to sacrifice. Then he's not safe until I've dealt with Kunan. Can you tend to his wounds? I am a very good healer. But if the gods want him to join them, I cannot stop their will. Eivor, what will you do with Kunon? I will reveal his sins. Let his people decide if he deserves an honorable death. The man tarnished your name and you would let him live? Shame for shame. Not even his guard will welcome him when I'm done. You are resolute then. Then may you ride as Rhiannon. Thank you, Modron. And please, take care of Tefter. I must get to Kunan before the festival's end. find Kunan before I'm spotted. The Longhouse is a good place to start. Festivities haven't started yet. There is still time to search for Kunan.
Where are you, Conan? He isn't here. Someone else may have seen him. Bridget is here. Oh, I shall polish my ears in hopes that a word of clarity will set through them. Eivor! Finally, Tiri de Hwalid! Bridget, uh, it is good to see you. Eivor! What has become of Tevder? Did you find your scarf? Uh, thank you. Gunnar, as well. Dowl am your whereabouts, and Dichel am your dathliadai. Bridget! I found an abandoned bird nest in the rafters! I'm going to take it home to Mother! If you gaddle it, then the babans will do it in all and lay a god. It's you again! The Sowan Butcher! The Sowan Butcher? Never mind. Gwyneth, it. I'm looking for Kunan. Have you seen him? He's busy with the festival and shooed me away to Bridget. Would you like to see some magic I've been practicing? Can you show me to Kunan if I say yes? Just one trick, and then I can show you around. Um, okay. So reach into this pouch. And the number of stones you're holding is... three. Wonderful magic, Gwen. But now I really need to find Kunan. Come on, let's go find him. There are the church ladies. They don't like the festival. But Anyway, to cluck cluck like hens. Do you want to see another trick? I can pull an acorn from your ear. I need to find Kuna. He's important. You're lost, Butcher. It's Eivor. I would know more about you, Gwyneth. You're certainly an odd little bird. Mother says there'll be no one like me in the whole of creation. From the dawn of dust to the end of sorrows. Your mother trusts you, lets you run about on your own. She spends the holiday blessing hermits in old rocks. What fun is that? And your father, Gwyneth. Where is he? Well, it's not to be spoken of, but I was born from the union of my mother with the horned king of the forest, Genunos. You're close with Bridget. She's like a big sister. But it's not like I'm going to get to see her much anymore once she leaves with you and Gunnar. How do you spend your days, Gwyneth? Collecting dead things for Mama's spells. I have quite a collection. Birds, mice, um, beetles. And I dance. And I can talk to cats. I should find Kunan. Please, or Tevder and Govlim. My priority speed depends on Rachib.
Why is that woman wearing a striped mask? That's a badger. All the festival ladies in charge wear one. Have you seen Elderman Kunan? Oh, that unholy visage startled me. It's past sundown, so Kunan has retired to the church for prayer. I have business with him. Even if you have business with him, it will have to wait until the morning. Locked himself in. Only Geva has the key. Would Geva let me in? She's been instructed not to. Not that I can see her following a task so simple. Girl'd forget her own head if it weren't attached. Thank you for your help. I will speak with Kunan tomorrow. The key is held by someone named Geva. I must find her. I'm looking for Glowerchester's elderman. <laughs> well, the one who still draws breath is in the church. How do I get in? You're not supposed to get in. No reason to enter that dump anyway. Fuck, you'd have to get me very drunk to show you inside. Terrible business. Sounds like so lad. I came stuff. as soon as I heard. Tefter is missing. Murdered. By those visiting Danes. <laughs> Have you seen Kunan? Hey, it's the Mary Ruid. Rhyme with me, Mary Ruid. On so a night, all out to fly, some to. Uh, oh, oh, you've oh, I've messed up the rhyme. The man tries to rhyme with all his might. <laughs> Didn't take much to outwit me. <laughs> You're really good. Good enough for a reward. Thanks. Enjoy the festival. Show me. Gasno, hey, and chilling with a jewel and I would know more about you, Gwyneth. Mother says there'll be no one like me in the whole of creation. From the dawn of dust to the end of sorrows. Have you seen Kunan? <laughs> the Marlet! Oh, goodness, you're so frightening. What are you doing after the festival? I am looking for Kunan. Right! Right, yes, he's in the church. Actually, if you're headed that way, this crate needs to be delivered to him. Just tell Geva I sent you. Of course. What does Geva look like? Badger mask, same as me. Should come running when she sees you. Best of luck, and happy sowing! Geva is waiting for this delivery to the church. 
That's my way in. Right, gotta keep my eye. Ah, the crate! Yes, yes, come this way. Good you came by. Sarah was supposed to drop it off ages ago. You are snake tongue. Hey, for <laughs> have you have you been enjoying the festivities? We are done with this shadow play. Tefter is safe, and I know of your plan to sacrifice him in your stead. You think I mean to escape the flames? I go to the Wicker Man gladly, but I will not leave Glowerchester in the hands of the Christian Zealot. Then what? Leave your people without a leader. And an angry church ready with holy fire. They won't be without a leader. Modron will sit upon the Horn's throne. Are you telling me that? Ha! <laughs> We've turned you in circles like a dog, haven't we? Modron was the architect of Tevder's murder, Avar. All to take control of Glowerchestershire for herself. It would be a hard grasp to hold, surrounded by Christians on all sides. There was no other way. She had a vision. Tevder framed by flames and burning. Everything we created together. Everything? You and Mothran. Then Gwynedd. A man must get his house in order before his death. Feather his nest for his children. You and the witch, this was your plan. To make me dance your merry tune. So you could build a legacy for your daughter. I always desired Modern. So when she asked me to take the part in a fertility ritual, of course I agreed. Our union conceived not only Gwenev, but a united Glowerchestershire. One that Tevder would stamp out. This is where you failed, Kunan. Tevder is a changed man. He straddles the same line as you. Tevder? The boy has the head of a mule. You taught him reason? Not just I. The kindness of bandits and strange Britons. He embraces Christ and Chernonos alike. Shit. Prophecy is a strange web, is it not? Tevder's reformation just needed a kidnapping and a dedicated Dane. Eivor, Modron will have taken Tevder to her forest temple. If you make haste, you might be able to stay her blade. I have much to attend to here, otherwise I'd lead you myself. Go now. <laughs> Unless you plan on killing me first. You are already a dead man. I will not make your people suffer for your actions. Thank you, Eivor. Your mercy will be rewarded, I'm sure.
do you see, Sunan? I must be careful now. your wings sooner. Mordren's voice. The mother is communing with the gods on this most holiest of times.
need to be careful here. and blood, death and birth. Turn this man from beast to earth. Modron, stay your blade or die at my hand. I should have known Kunon wouldn't have it in him to quarter you for the dogs. It's a cold bitch who throws her lover to the wolves for her own crimes. You understand so little. No matter. Let me enlighten you with the fury of the gods!
do it then. Leave Gloucestershire in the hands of that Christian, and for what? Your name and some trade routes? Do you doubt the power of your gods to sway the mind of a man? Tefter is no longer the sellout you believe him to be. A man will lie to save his skin. When you are gone, he'll gut me and burn my people. The gods showed me this. Kunan spoke of your vision. The Nornir spin their fatal threats. But without your plan, his heart would remain unchanged. Then I have no regrets. But I had a vision of you as well. One of a path that twists like the river owls. The seer's spinnings twist limb and word alike. Prophecy is a river, and we are powerless to fight its clutches. She was fighting to protect her people. But she ground your name to dust. Sullied the honor of herself and her people. I spared Kunan. Say your goodbyes and keep out of my sight, witch. Mother? What is this? Is this... Are we in hell? No. We are in England. How are you feeling? I feel well. <laughs> but it's a little fragrant in here, is it not? You will live to be Elderman yet, Tefter, despite the many attempts on your life. Attempts? Untimely death? God's blood! You're safe, and the ceremony will proceed in Gloucester. Your wounds should heal by the next moon, if you get some rest. Then you have my thanks, Mother Modrin. Lovely woman. Utterly terrifying, though. Let's return with haste. This cave is a place of nightmares. Guards here are vigilant.
I have returned. Gunner, it's good to see a face I trust. Even your frightful muck. I thought this could be our shared saga, but it's time to leave. We have spent not but a drink together. Worry not, Eivor. You and I have many tales to tell yet. And our names ring out clear and with honor. Yeah, a tale. A tale of Gloucester. Beautiful land. Full of damned fools. Ha! I will drink to that. You have my thanks. Anything for you, old friend. Then let us say our farewells to this wicker king, and then be on our way home. Yes, Ranvi will be eager to meet Bridget. Bridget and Gunnar have already gone ahead. I should join them. You owe me your prophecy, witch. And I shall give it. You are a great warrior, conqueror of this land, and that of your birth. But at the end of all things, you will find yourself with nothing but your regrets. I... I see.
first met at Simkin's Wicker Man Ascension. I was besotted with you at a glance. So long ago. Some poetic symmetry after twenty years prosperity. Grant. Please don't do it! We can find something else! Someone else! I will join the dirt that grows the trees and the barley. My body feeding the gods. Worms. And even you. So I will be here. And a long, long time from now. When you're old and wrinkled like an apple. <laughs> You will see me again. Father, I thought I could be ready. It is time. Then this is yours. This is your path, Tifter. No thorns and briars could keep you from it. And you, Eivor, friend of Gloucestershire. You have lived up to your reputation. I know you owe me less than nothing, but please, take care of them. I take no pleasure in the suffering of others. You would know this if you had given me a chance. Twenty years I have been your elderman. Now these old bones are ready for my last duty. I have worked alongside you, clearing fields, brewing drink, births, and deaths. All growing and learning. The wicker man is ready, O oh king. Your altar awaits. I am honored. To be your Harvest King. With this flame set, may our crops be plentiful and our winters brief. Despite it all, he has the ending he prayed for. Straight to the mouths of hungry gods. Eivor, the honor is yours. Praise the Harvest King! Bloody pagans! Now it seems the wind calls me back to Randy. Best tell her the good news.
Dave. Nice to see Sigurd back where he belongs. I would like to see what you have. Ah, that one's pretty good. This will serve you well. I can get you that one easy. I feel like a proud father. Look how strong. Done for now. I must take my leave. So long. May the sing of your deeds and my craftsmanship. <laughs> Always nice to see a friendly face. What do you have today? I must be on. Goodbye for now. Thank you for treating Hytham with respect and kindness, Eivor. He's found a family. He's more than welcome here, as are you. Pleasure to see you, Eivor. I can hardly begin to describe what happened in Gloucestershire. I think you will learn soon enough. But we are allied with them. Yes. For all our pains. Uber Ragnarsson has come. He claims to have some business with you. Uber Ragnarsson. You're a long way from your king's side. Eivor. Yes, a long stroll through the hills and fields of Mercia. All so I could thank you. Thank me? For sending my brother to his just reward. In spite of the harm he caused you and everyone around you, I could not keep him in line in this life. But I have no doubt the old father will put him to good use in the next. A darkness followed your brother, one I am not sure he understood. But as you say, he is now where he belongs. He is. And as a show of my thanks, I came to offer you a gift. A token of my respect. Thank you. Put it to good use, Wolfkist. And may we meet again soon. On a battlefield, if the fates are kind. Shall we? Please, Eivor. I want to see the Alliance.
I have received a unique summons from Snottinghamshire in the north. From your old friend, Billy. Billy? A name I have not heard in ten winters or more. How is he? Well, it seems. Vili asks that you join him in feast and celebration, in honor of his father, Heminger Jarl. A welcome invitation. It would be good to see him again. It is worth recalling that his father, Heminger Jarl, would be a formidable ally. Will you go? I will leave for Snottinghamshire today. Good. They will be pleased. This must be Snottingham. Saxon and Dane live in peace. I expected nothing less for land under Hemir Jarl's rule. Trick was both true. You have come to England. I have, and I mean to stay. Nottingham. It'll be good to see Vili again. Bathram! Fluga! For the meat! Eivor has come to Snottingham! Skull! Well, my pra- To 
I trust my own eyes? Is that truly who I see? Trigve, you old hound. How are you? Eivor, a friend of old is a good omen. Look at this. Your chin grass might be mistaken for hedges now. Ah, but a healthy Jarl beard it is not. And what of Vili? I was happy to get his message. I stand in Vili's place today. He and his father have gone to Ulkathorpe to stave off an invasion of Picts. We've laid a long siege, and Hemingryal looks to finish the job. Off looking for a fight? I should have known. Yes, Vili's sword always finds its way into trouble sooner or later. Not a bad way to live. In spite of these war cries, you should know that Vili's father is more frail than last you saw him. How could that be? Himingaryal is an ox. So he is. And he'll be pleased to skull with the moon in his jaws at the sight of you. Come. The swiftest path is by river. But these waters are hostile to Norsemen. You bring good luck with you. We could guide the sail steeds downstream. My ship will draw the arrows to let the convoy pass. Only give me a moment before we go.